Steps hasn't been here. To I have yeah. been here before. Good morning, it's DJ Debs, and I don't know why I'm gurney. I just want to clean my room. It's really messy. I've got bags everywhere. I'm going to clean out this bookshelf because today. I didn't know what I was going to do this morning because I've just come back from Glasgow just see my boyfriend I'm looking at so many flats we only got to look at one but he's going to look at two uh, next week so yeah hopefully we find a flat soon in Glasgow because I'm moving I need to get out here and I just need to clean my room I want to come home one day to Inverness and my room is still a tip it's really bad I mean look at this shelf it's messy isn't it that's why I'm cleaning out the shelf and uh, my whole room so let's get to it and take all the stuff to a charity shop in somewhere in the Highlands and Islands. Some of the books I'm throwing out are Tales by Potter. I'm throwing out some Star Wars Clone Wars comic books. I've read these all. These I've had not. I can't be even bothered. I do like the movie, Mrs. Potter, but no, I'm not reading the books. I've read all these. I mean, there's like tons of them I've got. I mean, just look, all that. I've read all that. It's really good. I like Star Wars too much. I like the comic Star Wars. Clone Wars. Love the war. <laughs> Wouldn't like to be in it. Who would like to be in World War II? Uh, I'm throwing out all the Friends videos because I've got them all on DVD, the whole series, 1 to 10. Oh my goodness. I love Friends. I would like a Friends reunion. Who wouldn't? Um, but I'm not throwing out this. Need keep this down and fell. Love you guys so much. Seriously, you inspired me to do YouTube. Uh, Superwoman has no sort of people. I, I just like down and fell. I cannot get rid of this and I cannot get rid of their other book. The first one of this, but yeah, that's some of the books I'm throwing out. I'm definitely not throwing this book out. I like these kind of books, it tells you what how they made the movie. Very small books, I had to read the movie. I think I have books. Can't get rid of that. I can't get rid of my Barbie DVDs. Yeah, I have Barbie DVDs. I can't get rid of them. Seriously, like, that's them. Can't get rid of them. Just can't. Then books I will get rid of. Some of them I will. Especially some childhood ones down here, I will too. Let's get rid of them and get out of here. Let's take them all to the charity shop. Now! Those. Can you put that on mine, please? And a little bit of ketchup. Oh, is that right? Thank you. Yeah. No. No, you're not. So, did you hot chocolate? Not anymore. Not anymore, yeah. I'm just in Subways and I'm just showing mum where me and Ryan were looking at for flats. That's the one we looks at. Mm -hmm. Two bedrooms, I had a kitchen in the living room, bathroom was small, it had a weird cupboard. Size. Mm -hmm. Size is cupboard. That was the street they want to look at. No, no, actually that was the one. It's a really good price, it's only £375 a month. And security is so good. The person who showed us couldn't get in. <laughs> got gas. It's also got furniture for us. Two double beds. Sofa. It looks really good. And washing machine. That's a good thing. You're my sweet. Looks nice and bright in there. It really does. And seriously, you can't hear like traffic outside. It's double glazing. Mm -hmm. So that's the kitchen. It's inside yeah. the living room. At least you can't forget what you're doing cooking. You well, at least I don't have to leave Ryan alone in the kitchen because I'm just right there in the mm -hmm. living room. Good. Looks, Looks good. My hair's been it's cut off. Debs hasn't been here to I have yes. been here before. I didn't know that. You just put it in that green I'm going in the donation shop. I'll put one bag box. up and I'll go in the shop. <laughs> you can't be dad in the book corner. I am too comfy, to be honest. <laughs> Just got away from Blytheswood, just gave like more than 81 books to Blytheswood. Woo! That would help with people who need education and food more than me. <laughs> uh, I'm in the front, Dad's in the back. He's tired from taking me from the train station. I'm watching UB40. <laughs> what? UB40 at the concert. 
Oh, yeah, I was watching oh, UB40, that's why he's saying the word UB40. Okay. He was watching him last night and then he picked up me at like 11 and then we, we, we got home at midnight. Left. That's why he's tired, that's why he's in the back and that's why I'm in the front. I'm always in the front. I like the front. I'm lucky. Anyway, heading home from Blizzard. Dad, where did you watch the concert? Just outside in the court on the steps. Debs, I've got a fantastic view of the stage and of the band. Dad didn't need to get it all. No. I knew you did get one from Forest with Juice, but I didn't have to. Dad! Yeah. What's recording? The Paris um, Grand Prix in the city of Paris. It's racing cars through Paris. So you see motor cars go past the Eiffel Tower. That, in cities, that's a rare thing. You've got to get special permission to do that. They're trying to do it in, in, in Britain. I've been to Paris and that's where they are. This is so cool. Oh, we're almost finished. We're on lap 43. I'm not into this at all, seriously, but it's like it's getting filmed next to the Tower. I'm like, I'm staying on the channel and watching it. I just want to see who, like, who wins. And where is the. Oh my goodness. Now that's a nice day out. That's a nice day out, especially there in Paris, because here it's like raining very badly. I'm not liking the rain at all. You saw it when we were in the car, like it's raining. I hate the rain, it's what you get in Scotland, rain. Sunshine's in Paris right now. Lucky French people, lucky you guys. Cool. Technology is so cool these days, like, That's a nice view. I think it's like the top of the Eiffel Tower. I'm not sure. That's Malibu by Miley Cyrus. I like her hair now. It's back to normal. I like her like this. She, did, she recorded that song in our radio studio. Kind of a brilliant name. Weird but brilliant name. A small little place. Anyway, uh, I'm chilling out in my chill zone. I finally found it in my room. I've cleaned up my bookshelf. New books in there. Look, you see all my YouTube books. Uh, Michelle, uh, Nummy Nummies, Dan and Phil books. All good in there. I've sorted out these books too. I've sorted out that I found at my chill zone. I've really sorted out my room. It looks so, so much bigger now. I have bigger space. It looks so good. I'm liking it. I really am. Anyway, right now I'm going to look for some jobs in Glasgow and Inverness. I need a summer job. So, let's get cracking like into it. And then later on, BGT. Britain's Got Talent. I'm just on my computer looking for jobs. And the website I use to look for jobs is opportunities.creativescotland.com. It doesn't just show you jobs in the creative industries. It shows you so much more like awards, competitions, uh, calling for entries, uh, fundraising, masterclasses, workshops, volunteering, research. Hello! Yeah, sure, pity on. Like I was saying, the opportunities.creativescotland.com website is so good. I use it so many times. Just look at jobs when I have a job or when I don't have a job. I just got an email from my um job that I applied for and I didn't get in. Sorry to confirm. I enjoyed that interview, right? Well that was dream interviews that I went for this week and I didn't get any of them. Well it's a good thing I'm looking for jobs right now. Sorry, I'm a little bit upset right now. Um, anyway, I do have a kind of job in Glasgow, but I just have to hand one more thing in and then I can get some shifts. It's gravy. I knew this girl looked familiar! Get ready, Destiny. We've got four yeses. Thank you. 
when Destiny says she was from Malta, I was like, oh, I love Malta. And she said she's from the Eurovision Junior Competition 2015. I remember her! Some girl from Malta in 2015 winning the Junior Eurovision Contest. And I remember watching it. I watched the Eurovision 2015 with a guy from Austria. I'm so glad Destiny got four yeses. I thought she was going to get a gold buzzer. I think they're all gone by then. But anyway, let's go back downstairs and watch it. BGT. Britain's Got Talent. That's me coming to the end of my day. Just watched BGT, Lethal Weapon. While I was watching that, I've been like sitting here being creative. There is like so much piece of papers here. Glue, Tipex, paper. I've been being very creative here. I've been working on a sketchbook that I got from Aberdeen. You can check it out in one of the vlogs when I went to Aberdeen. I basically have done this. So in the book, in the first... So in the book... So in the book... You see stories come to life. This is one of my stories that have come to life. This is the girl with wings. She lives here. Her house, the beach nearby, down the hill. And the story about the beginning, the middle, and the end. And the characters. I'm not going to say any more about it because it's not written up. It's just a draft of the story coming to life. And on the back, we have just, well, that. The beast. The alphabet of friendship. My favourite one's photo. Because this photo, this photo is friendship. It's got Finn, Lucy, me, and two of the girls. These guys are studying in forest. I think they're doing um graphics and development with Glasgow School of Arts. I know I said it's in forest, but actually it's in forest. They have different campuses all around Scotland. So this is one friendship photo I have. I'm going to stick it in this scrapbook I've shown you. And then I'm going to leave it for say. I did try to get in touch with Ryan to show my clean, tidy room that it has a chill zone. Ryan says I don't relax. And it's true. And I just make myself a chill zone. So hopefully that will help for we while before I go to Glasgow. Anyway, stick that in. Oh, I haven't seen in ages. Hopefully I see Lucy again because she's just in Glasgow. Uh, anyway, I'm going to turn this camera off. So you can give it a thumbs up, comment below and subscribe. And I'll see you next time. This has been Danger Depths. The opposite of danger. That's better.